actually I won't like to be called as an entrepreneur. Because basically I am a physician, a doctor who is interested in eye disease. And I was working as a teacher in academy. So in the colleges we are handling more about theories. But when, they doc when he become a doctor, their responsibility is to bring all these theories into practical. That was what I was trying. According to Ayurvedic theory, the theories are very, uh, very basic and uh, very tough actually. And to bring all these theories in the practical level, that is the problem. So, I was just uh, trying to solve this problem. For that, facilities are necessary and support from the latest technologies are necessary. And uh, that was only what I was doing to, to uh, add the technologies or to cooperate with other um, person to implement or to make practical the Ayurvedic theories. Then whether if you are calling that as an entrepreneur, that is okay. Otherwise, I will uh, like to be called as a doctor only. There are so many hurdles for that. Because the preparations and uh, mode of application, etc. At, at that time, it is uh, the theories are from Vedic period onwards. And it is it was suitable to that period. Now the scenario is much different. And highly uh, different. So we have to cope with that present scenario. For that, modifications are necessary. And for this modification, we can add so many technologies and uh, knowledge of other systems, other science, etc. can be utilized. That was what we are trying now. And then only we can uh, flourish or we can uh, practice Ayurveda in this period. For example, in early ages, the medicines are preparing at that time. Now it is not possible. People are wandering here and there and there are no, no time. So, from the very beginning, the, the Kotakil Advisal or PS Warrior has tried, was implementing to prepare the medicines and sell it to the patients. At that time, it was a very great, very uh, great step. And later in that way, so many companies and so many persons have tried to implement so many modifications for the benefit of Ayurveda, especially in the preparation of medicines and also the mode of application in that. And in the case of eye disease, this becomes um, very tough because people are highly conscious about their vision and we know the value of vision. So to join everything, to incorporate everything is very uh, difficult. So the, we have to, the preparing, preparing medicine should be very scientific and hygienic level and much uh, care and uh, um, dedication is necessary for that. And that was what I was trying in my, um, in my practice as a doctor. So for that, there was support from my family members then only we can do that. So actually, um, when I was trying, actually what happened to start a hospital was very interesting, the incidents. It was not as a um, high level hospital implementation or a startup, not like that. It was just for treating a patient. There was no facilities uh, outside the ho in the hospital, I mean in the college. So uh, actually he was very um, near to me and I had to uh, treat him immediately. So a rendered building was taken to accommodate them. And for them I had to entrust a um, young doctor. I was giving the instructions and he was taking care of them. And like that it was a four room uh, rendered building. That was the beginning of the hospital, not a hospital you can say just a um, place to treat a patient and then after that it became a routine yes. people were then i could understand that people are highly satisfied and highly uh, um, safe 
in such a situation to get the treatment in a, to get it done in a very good level and having a supervision from an expert doctor and in a very hygienic and very safe atmosphere and it was continuing. Then the facility became, um, um, it has, we had to improve it because more patients were coming. Then we started, um, decided to shift it to an own building. Like that it was developing. So in each step we are taking more interest or more dedication and care to keep on the Ayurvedic theories, not to deviate from that. If you are deviating from that, it is not Ayurveda. So, without deviating the theory or the basic uh, aspects of Ayurveda, to add to or to implement the modern facilities and technologies are a tough um, point. That is to be solved. That is we are trying to solve now. And it is really it is a success, I think. That is why people from uh, all places, because I think people are more interested in Ayurveda. They believe in Ayurveda. So we have to satisfy their needs. That is the problem now. People are interested, they need Ayurveda, they want Ayurveda, they believe Ayurveda. All over the world. But they have to get a place where they get all these things in a um, successful way, satisfactory level. There should be an um, expertise doctor, there should be an uh, expertise therapist and there should be dedicated service uh, providers. And this is what is needed in, this, uh, in the hospital now. And, and we are trying to fulfill all these aspects in our hospital. Then it will be a success. It is a success of, of course. That is my experience.